Good afternoon. I'm Mary Ellen Jackson. I'm the Executive Director of the New Hampshire Center for Nonprofits. I'm not sure if you know, but there are three sectors that make up our economy, government, business, and nonprofit sector. And we hear a lot about the government. We know it pretty well. And we hear about business, and we know how uh, the impact of the business community is on our economy. But sometimes we don't think about the nonprofit sector. Uh, when you think the word nonprofit, you might think of charitable organizations, organizations that do good, and that's exactly what nonprofits do, but they're also part of everyday life. Our center just came out with a report called Essential, a portrait of the nonprofit sector in New Hampshire. And in this report, we describe how more than um, the sector raises more than eight billion dollars. Nonprofit organizations employ uh, one in eight workers in New Hampshire. And there are actually 7,800 nonprofits in New Hampshire. And they range from everything from an after school program to the Audubon to uh, uh, arts and cultural organizations. They also include your local library. They include Meals on Wheels for Senior Citizens. They also include organizations like Habitat for Humanity. But people don't think about the nonprofit sector as a vibra vibrant economic um, engine in our community. Part of it is that nonprofits are funded uh, by donations and by government grants. And in this economic time, it is tremendously difficult for these small organizations to keep the food pantries open and the homeless shelters going. And they're so busy, nonprofit leaders doing the work, that often there isn't enough time to market the, or to market the sector to let everybody know what meaningful work is. So I would say one of the most uh, significant challenges in the nonprofit sector is to get the word out to raise visibility and so that everyone realizes that the nonprofit sector not only contributes socially and to our common good and to the quality of life here in New Hampshire, but also is a very significant economic contributor.